Hello. Welcome to Shop Talk. We're going to look at that McCullough 440 chainsaw. That was produced in 1963. 5.3 cubic inch, 87 cc. Power head on that weighs 21 pounds. Very popular saw for the Pacific Northwest for cutting the big wood. This one features a 36 inch cannon bar roller nose with a very nice piece of uh, Oregon 52 AJ chain. A very rare chain and that chain is brand new. Skip tooth sequence point 064044 chain. And we'll take a close up look at some of the features it had back in the 60s. It has an automatic oiler plus a manual override. And that manual override on the left side here, and you just pump it when you need some more oil. Get into some pitchy wood. Kill switch is in the middle. Choke's on the right, and you just push it in and hold it. Got the large falling spike. And there's the automatic oiler I was telling you about right there. That is an automatic oiler. You'll see this on a lot of the McCullough big saws. And it is adjustable. You loosen this nut and back the screw out or take it in. Screw it in for more or less oil. Back it out for more. It's just a little old stopper and changes the uh, stroke of the uh, piston in there. Here's the starter side. That's a brand new muffler. And I want to show you something pretty unique about this saw. It's clean underneath there. They had a lot of trouble with the original carburetors and uh, back on the later 60s you could buy a, an adapter and change out that carburetor to one of the newer carburetors for that age. And you see that adapter right here, so we can get on there. Well, and that made it possible to put the very popular carburetor you'll recognize underneath there. I'm gonna take that cover off there if I can. Now I can get a good shot of it. See that newer style carburetor in this older saw? That flange right there you could put on there. Made that a real nice feature. That saw just purrs and runs just beautiful. We'll go outside and make a cut with it now. <laughs> 